Hello everyone and welcome to part 3. Um, in this video, this will just be a, a short update uh, what I've done in the meantime. Um, so it ain't really a part 3 but I'm calling it anyway or, or some guys will probably get confused. So in the part 4, that's actually part 3, I'm going to be, sh I'm going to be show you um, how I'm going to build my crack cup to frame. But just a quick update, um, I soldered on the 3.5mm bullet connectors, I've got the male bullet connector here and the female on the ESCs, and I've turned that to all the, the ESCs and the motors, um, 24 in total, and I've p put some heat shrink over them to don't get shocked whenever I touch those, so it'll be a sure connection. and. Um, just another little thing I did um, was that I got an idea. Um, I got the power distribution board here. I got an idea. Um, well, I I did solder on this these two wires too, and these will be going down to an XT60 connector that I got on the way from the Hobby King store, and these will just be plugged into the battery here. And um, I've got an idea that. I will solder on some wires like these, um, 12 gauge wires. I'm going to be soldered on here and here, 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 and here, here, and those will be going up to an XT60 connector. And those XT60 connectors will connect to the ESCs here, and the ESCs will have a XT60 connector on them as well. So I can always change them out, upgrading them, and I can just take the ESCs and the motors out, put them in an airplane if I want to, uh, without having to unsolder and solder on some connectors and everything like that. And also I get a little bit of length by adding this, so I get about 7 centimeters or so more. Um, and another thing um, is this, I found out I did only have this one male to male server connector. And I'm going to be plucking all these C's, these in here, to my KK controller board. And I don't know if you can see them there. Well, I don't know if you can see them, but here, there's some some connectors like that. And out here it says aileron, elevator, uh, throttle, and rudder control. So these will be going with a male to male connection. It'll be going from here and down to the receiver over here. And I do need four of those and I did only have three. So I bought just I think it was a set of ten um, which will be arriving shortly I hope. Another thing I got is uh, these nylon screws here and they are five millimeter uh, thick and I've got these nylon bolts too and because it's nylon it's um it's because that if, if I did have a, a bad solder um, that connects to one of these holes in the KK board um, if I did have a metal screw it could lead and the electrics down to the another plate I've got under. So, and it was just, excuse my language, but fuck it all up. And um, that's why I got the nylon. And um, I bought this, this tube here, um, this 5mm, um, the hole is 5mm, right there, or so. And that means it'll fit the nylon screws here. And I'm gonna use it as a spacer so I can get the KK board just a little bit over the wood. Um, and I can get some foam between it and the, the screws and the nylon space and the bolts. Um, so it wouldn't um, be interrupted by the vibrations. That was just the, the quick little update. Um, be sure to uh, follow on, on Facebook, subscribe uh, to my YouTube channel uh, for more updates and of course follow the blog. Every link will be in the description below and um, 
yeah, leave a comment if you're in doubt and if I if you have a question I'll try to answer it.